So I'm a huge Tool fan. I think they are an extraordinary band. It, they are my favorite band. But when I heard A Perfect Circle, I think the first couple tracks that I or that I know that I really like are uh, Three Libras and what's the other one? Judith. So those I those I really like. I think when I first heard them, I didn't know it was Maynard at the time. But I still like the music anyway. However, I kept listening to Tool forever. Still do to this day. Love them. Listen to them constantly. But I never really got into a perfect circle. And so I'm going to try it. I'm going to try out Perfect Circle. Listen to a few of their songs. And see see if I like these as much as I liked the first two. So this song, uh, I think, is a pretty popular tune from what I from what I discovered. It's called The Outsider. It's off of the album 13th Step. I don't think I've ever heard this before. And so I just want to listen to it and find out uh, if I need to add it to my, my Maynard playlist. Let's go. Base. Ooh, dirty. I already know that I've I've been missing out, man. This is it's already so good. It's uh, what is it? I, I don't know. What is it about Maynard and everything he touches is kind of awesome. I, yeah, I mean, obviously the the mates are the the bandmates or the the band members of a perfect circle have changed apparently over the years, but God, it still sounds it sounds so good. That dirty, dirty bass, that clean guitar at the beginning. And I don't have the lyrics up, but, you know, if I go back and look at the lyrics, I'm sure it's going to be interesting. I mean, everything that Maynard does makes you makes you think and you're just kind of in awe of. Oh, I've been missing out already. I, I already like it. It's, I don't know if I noticed this in the other Perfect Circle songs. And I don't know how much influence Maynard has, obviously, on this band. I don't. I know very little about it. I know a lot more about Tool. But a similarity is that you hear that like in this tune, and it's just not... It's just not a typical sound you would hear in a song, because you're not quite sure what it is. It's Maybe a guitar with some effect on it or something. But it's just so cool to hear these different sounds that you you just don't expect and it, it just and it sounds good. It's not just there to grab your attention or whatever. It sounds like it fits. It sounds like it fits and it sounds good. Oh so so dirty.
It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> it's um, you can't help but compare it to Tool. I think because that's probably why I like it. Obviously, because there's so many similarities. Unique sound, dark, dirty, emotional. There's already uh, several different changes or different different ideas. Probably uh, not as many, and maybe not as drastic as you would hear in in typical tool but it's still so good it's just so good when when they express these different ideas that still in my opinion fit with kind of the main theme of the tune so they venture off of kind of the established path and they take you on a little bit of a different journey but you can still tell that it's related and then they'll and then they'll bring it back i think that's one of the things i i just love about tool and you can hear it pretty clearly in this and then that man that dark guitar wow that that was surprising because that even sounds darker than some of the tool stuff awesome this is like immediately going to the playlist change up here. Nice double kick there. For some reason, I th I was thinking a perfect circle. Their tunes would be more like three libras, which I think is more of a like a more mellower sound. But this is this is heavy. This is this is hard. This is like a workout playlist song, and I didn't expect that. So very happy I listened to this tune. Awesome. God. I, I, pros and cons of not listening to this album um, for the first 21 years of its existence. Came out in 2003. Yeesh. I could have been enjoying this for 20 some years and I wasn't, but I'm happy I found it now. Fucking amazing. Uh, Maynard. Um, I don't have the lyrics up, but yeah, I mean, Maynard, obviously, he he just kills it every single song. He seems to just consistency and, and crushing it. Awesome. Uh, loved all of it. All of it. Everything was great. Bass, guitar, drums, they all had their little moments of like, ooh, nice. Uh, fantastic. Fantastic tune. Now I'm super jazzed. Uh, I cannot wait. Um, I'm gonna listen to. I'm gonna listen to more of this album. Freaking awesome. Nice job. Nice job, Maynard. Nice job, Perfect Circle. 